which being entitled after power from living, Ms. Noor Izzati Zakata. Very good evening to Mr. Chairman, to the honorable judges, to the accurate timekeepers, and to all my friends. Today, I would like to talk about the topic of my speech entitled Power from Within. Ladies and gentlemen, there are too many souls shall pass idolatral life without blooming into their fullest and vibrance of colors. The tragedy is not a shortcoming alone, but, but that so few realize the essence of their unlimited potentials. For as long as I can remember, I have a strong connection to, to that which I can only describe as beyond, my, beyond, um, uh, as beyond me is that a source of greater than my individual self. Okay, let me tell you for example, an example. For instance, a writer, you know, to write is to escape and this is some sort of an outlet of release. And, um, okay, uh, and as the patient came together to, to share and, uh, okay, uh, to share and to improve their craft, they are all looking amongst and on behalf of one another each individual setback is a setback of us all, and each individual contribution is shared by greater whole. And yet, for all that, we as human, each and every individual being is completely exceptional and wholly unique. And within our imperfect completeness, each human being naturally possesses unlimited wealth of potential. All of these, when freedom allowed and as nurtured is uh, and nur as nurtured properly, lead to human life's greatest and most humble of aspirations. Power from within, which I bring to you about, is a series of deeply rooted personal beliefs that I strive to live by. These theories are based upon self-discovery and selfless among others. I can only hope that these principles is, can provide some inspiration and guidance for all of you. Okay, you know, before we develop our conscious understanding about our world and our living condition, we are born into a series of circumstances that we are influenced beyond our control. And the very creations of, of our lives that have been in, and the very creations of our lives uh, was facilitated by others and was detected by chance. With time, we slowly gain greater cognizance of what's around us and slowly, gradually, we understand the people, the place, the things interact as a part of the something much larger. Okay, to talk about these circumstances, let me tell, uh, give you uh, these two situations. Firstly, to the children's hub who lives in the South Arabian America, who is like a life close um, within regimented um, education and limitless imagination. They are, they are each material comfort and is as, as shine as sun that um, bright to the whole world. And this is their world. And secondly, to the children who live in, in the um, Calcutta of India, life ebbs and flows between suffering and stagnancy, sickness and death, rubbish line the dirt streets, and, they, and um, the children run away among this um, rubbish as uh, obstacles of the kids of hide and seek. And this is Tiawan. However, no matter what circumstances we are lived by, we as humans grow into maturity and um, have a unity, a most powerful thing that 
Allah gives to us is to acclaim every injustice of circumstances that we are born into. Ladies and gentlemen, we are but six. Within the confines of a shell, a so small level of level potential for growth and colors to this purpose beyond our will, but to bloom is by our own choice. For example, this is power from within, you know. By the power of choice, the child of South America can one day reach the slums of uh, Calcutta to tend to the sick and to uh, educate the illiterate. And uh, by the power of choice also, the child of the Calcutta can raise his family of poverty to the comfortable and prosperity and new life of his family. And of course, um, the choice alone cannot um, ensure success. The battle is hardly an easy task, you know. Nevertheless, human will, human will ensures the ability of all human beings to harness the power of choice and push your entries or go. No one is ever made without real first our first choice to pursue it. As Lao Tzu said uh, right ages ago, the journey of a thousand miles began with one step. No matter how distant the vision of our dream, nothing but choice can begin to pursue itself. As human beings, the power of choice is already and always within us. Ladies and gentlemen, as the implications of our attitudes and behaviors can radically benefit the beliefs who those we live really among, to strive to better our inner self also means to benefit all those up uh, to means to benefit the needs of all everyone around us. Okay? To enhance the practice to be better and happier for such, to bring out the very best of our unique personalities talents, keeps, and patience. Mm -hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, my dear friends, not just our souls with whom we personally interact, but others who they, who they interact with that very day, tomorrow, and forever throughout time. As our life impact can affect everyone around us, the gift of life requires upon uh, and important responsibilities to us to live the life most fully and upon our terms. Remember, firstly, to follow our heart. Secondly, to do in life of, of what our spirit to call us to pursue and to do, to both live and uh, believe in um, the, for the betterment of everyone and lastly to go beyond our mere survival is that to thrive. Lastly, we may choose to live this life immersed in our world and among our people or to die having life in spite of them. The latter perhaps the most regrets of all but, but the former promises a wealth of richness and joy that can and shall forever always be flourish. That's all for me. Thank you very much.
built uh, some sort of hospital uh, which is free for all of um, people and um, many people from many stages such as children or whatsoever to came to here and to to gain their benefits from the hospital. Okay, uh, I mean to get the free uh, of charge of uh, treatment. Okay, and then. I will and then I will um, I will uh, do a charity and donor to the um, pet to the uh, I will do the donor and charity to those who need it, such as um, children in um, who is in their poverty and whatsoever like that. And um, also I will put I will build uh, the the clinic. Okay. okay. In the slums area, such uh, for for the mother, like uh, mother and children in the maternal healthcare and children healthcare, uh, for all uh, all of us to gain uh, the the uh, opportunity to get the uh, real treatment of uh, our industry. Okay. Um, okay. Also. I uh, want to supply my money to do a campaign such as working um, for children or um, campaign of um, food to be uh, choose a great uh, a good food to be uh, um, what healthy in the life and whatsoever and I will um, choose a celebrity to be an idol for them because you know celebrity uh, can be a much good impact of the community in our uh, country and this will also make uh, we to be more um, what we call it closer to them and inshallah uh, our program will be uh, our health will be uh, what we call it the program will be smooth to be done. Okay, um, that's to the mother and the children. And now we go to the old folks. Uh, to the old folks, uh, we might uh, give them some, to, um, some sort of apparatus, such as um, wheelchair to them, and buy the some sorts of that medicine for them and um, um, what we call it give, uh, give them education on how to um, lead their life in their end of life to be um, more productive such as that not to wait for um, for them to die on you that And I'm also hope that uh, this will, um, as a billionaire, um, such a like a, we are going to be minister, no, 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 like that, because uh, it is kind of uh, we can join with the, uh, the others country to provide the medical treatment to. Uh, to them to come to our country and such a, uh, to 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 have the treatments of uh, what we are going to have now. Uh, okay, for all that, I hope that. This uh, kind of um, steps that I could um, give to all the citizen and citizens in the country would make those people in our country healthy and stay fit and whatever to um, gain our economy um, and our economy to be better from the previous world. Okay, that's all for me. Okay, on your prepared speech, I uh, divide into your content and your delivery. Okay, um, on the good side of the content, uh, it was.
was uh, very well structured. The topic you chose you chose was very unique in the sense that you talk about uh, India and all the problems there is a bit uh, different from the other contestant. And you have a very uh, uh, strong point, and I like it that you put in a lot of quotes. That's why I didn't record everything. And another good point in your delivery part was that you have a nice eye contact. So, and your sweet smile. <laughs> okay, for the delivery part, um, you delivered it uh, very nicely, but uh, there's this one, uh, this one problem is, uh, not one, a few fair problems. Uh, number one is that you were holding a tax, right? So um, when you hold the text, you actually limit yourself from your body language. You have to have a lot, a lot more body gesture. And then the, um, the second one is about your intonation, how you pronounce all the stuff. It's a bit, um, what you call it, a bit like an announcer. You know, when you go to the airport and so like a but uh, it's a good way, but a bit boring in the sense that it's like very flat too. You have a nice intonation but it's very flat. It's like from the beginning to the end it's like that. You have to have like, you have to emphasize on some words and to make it more interesting. And the next one is about your pronunciation. Uh, in your prepared speech, uh, I noticed that you have um, a different, uh, you're not consistent with your pronunciation. Once you said benefit and once you said better, a bet, better, you know, you have to um, be consistent on your pronunciation and you have to pronounce clearly. So when you did not pronounce uh, clearly, it's a bit difficult to get your points. So you have uh, your, your your points, I mean your contents of your delivery. Okay, for uh, about your uh, this impromptu. impromptu speech, um, it was good. <laughs> Nice, uh, nice point. You state the point clearly. Uh, the good thing is you're a bit calm, but I know you're nervous. Um, you have the same mistake about pronunciation. This time I noticed your R. And the and the you said the and the going going to my mind. And you have to um, grab some grammar mistake. But I understand it's an impromptu speech. So okay, I think that's all.